All right, today I'm gonna to talk about one of my favorite things to biohack to help you increase your energy, extend life, and so much more. And what we're gonna talk about today is AMPK. And it's a very important protein that your body makes. And one of the things that happens when you age is you get a decline in activation of AMPK. So today I'm gonna to give you some things that you can do to help you increase your AMPK and I'm also going to share some of the many benefits that you get when you activate AMPK. Now, if you're new to my channel, my name is Nathan Walls. I help people look younger and feel younger. And I do that using the science of energy optimization. So things like improving the health of your mitochondria. That's how your body makes energy. Improving autophagy. That's cellular repair. Uh, increasing different anti-aging pathways of which AMPK is one of those. And these are the same things I did to cure my symptoms of fatigue, brain fog, anxiety, indigestion when I was suffering from Lyme disease about seven years ago. So let's go ahead. Let's jump right into it. But AMPK is it. Uh, increases your body's energy production and it also plays a role in energy balance or homeostasis and if you've seen some of my past videos I've t I talk about homeostasis and when our body's in homeostasis we have good health when we lose homeostasis that's when we move towards disease so if you want to live a long life if longevity and life extension is your goal if being your very best and performing really well is important to you, then you want to do things to keep your body in homeostasis. And one of those things is activating AMPK. And AMPK has a number of benefits, but it's one of the things, one of the keys to your longevity and anti-aging. So let's look. AMPK, it improves your cardiovascular health. So heart disease, it's still the number one killer today. So by activating your AMPK, you're going to reduce your risk for heart disease. Uh, let's see, you decrease your risk and you can actually uh, reverse type 2 diabetes. And one of the reasons is, is because when you activate AMPK, that increases insulin sensitivity. And when you become insulin resistant, that's what drives, or that's one of the drivers, that's one of the main drivers for type two diabetes. So by consistently activating AMPK, you are going to reverse that. Uh, AMPK increases or it improves autophagy. So autophagy is key to staying young. That's how your cells maintain themselves. So autophagy is one of the ways your cells take out the trash. When your mitochondria make energy, there's metabolic waste. And when your cells are young, they're very, they're very good at clearing out that waste. But with age comes older cells. And one of the things that makes your cells old is they become less efficient at clearing metabolic waste. Autophagy also helps to renew your cells. So just from your cells making all these different proteins and compounds and things to keep your body healthy things over time things break down so with autophagy they repair the broken down parts parts they recycle the parts that are no longer good they get rid of the trash and they keep your cells young and healthy which keeps you young and healthy uh, it increases mitochondrial biogenesis so you can actually make new mitochondria. One of the ways to do that is by activating AMPK. And your mitochondria, like I said earlier, they're the powerhouse of the cell. They make energy for your body. And it's kind of like the engine in your car. So you can give your, your car or, or pump up with the best fuel available, high test gas. But if your engine is broken, the fuel or the food in our case is isn't really going to do you that much good. You've got to fix the engine. And part of that fixing the en engine is mitophagy, mitochondrial re repair, autophagy, cellular repair, but also mitochondrial biogenesis, making new mitochondria. 
And if we go back to the car analogy, it's almost like increasing the horsepower in your car. So you're essentially increasing your horsepower when you make new mitochondria. Uh, let's see, AMPK increases fat burning. So if you're trying to lose some weight, you definitely want to be activating AMPK. It also helps your body to burn sugar more easily. So one of the things that happens with diabetes is you have insulin resistance, so you're not burning your sugar as well. This helps you to burn burn your sugar and it stores less sugar. So if you store too much sugar, that, that is stored fat, essentially. That sugar turns into fat. So with AMPK, when you activate that, that's going to help you burn more of that sugar, which is a very quick fuel source. So that's very good for, for exercise or when you're in the gym, things like that. It um, acts as an antioxidant because it upregulates something called NRF2, which also has a lot of anti-aging benefits. And it also increases SOD, superoxide dismutase, which you need to maintain good energy production. AMPK also decreases inflammation and it helps to inactivate a, um, an inflammatory compound called nuclear um, factor kappa beta. So lots of benefits. Let's say what else. It increases your blood flow. So another thing that happens with aging is your circulation is not as good. And when you have decreased circulation, you have less blood flow going to your cells, which means you get less nutrients going to your cells. It also means you have less waste removal from your cells. So you want to keep your circulation good. Also with low circulation, lots of times are uh, an easy indicator to know that you have low circulation is you get cold hands and feet. And if you have cold hands and feet, that means your brain is not getting enough blood flow either, which means your brain is not working at full capacity. And for a final benefit of upregulating up or activating AMPK, it increases testosterone production. So if you're a man, if you're trying to pack on weight, if you want to maintain your sex drive and have good drive and motivation, testosterone is involved in all of those. So doing things to activate AMPK are going to help uh, increase your testosterone along with all the other benefits that I mentioned. Now, what do we do to upregulate AMPK? Uh, number one is quality sleep. So when you're sleeping well, a lot of the things I mentioned actually happen in your sleep, but you need quality sleep. So when it's dark out, you want to be sleeping for a good majority of when it's dark as opposed to being a night owl, staying up really late, going to bed really late, and then sleeping into the daylight. So you want to be really focused on quality sleep. Exercise also activates AMPK. So you want to be doing something every day that gets your heart pumping, gets your blood flowing, and that is going to activate AMPK. Also intermittent fasting or fasting in general, but when you sleep, that's essentially a fast. And when you skip breakfast, that's extending that fast. Or if you skip dinner, that's extending that period of time your body's fasting. That is going to activate more AMPK. Uh, also cold exposure. So one of my favorite hacks, I combine all four of those things to really activate AMPK. And twice a week on Tuesdays and Thursdays, uh, I endeavor to get good sleep every single night. So that's one of my uh, hacks I do every single night. Though occasionally I do have, uh, I don't get a great night's sleep. Sometimes things happen. But 95, 97% of the time, I'm getting a good sleep. So my body's doing a lot of autophagy. It's activating AMPK. And then in the morning, I'll fast on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I'll also do some sprints. So I'll do four to five hill sprints. And that is a great activator of AMPK. It's a super quick workout. And then I'll combine that with a cold bath. So sometimes I do the, the sprints pre-bath. Sometimes I'll do them after the bath. I like to just experiment and change things around. But by doing those four things together, they have a synergistic effect. So I'm getting even more of a benefit. So quality sleep, intense exercise, uh, cold exposure, and 
fasting as well. I also add some different compounds. So I'll cover different compounds that activate AMPK in a different video. But these things that I mentioned, these are all very foundational. So just supplementing your way to activate AMPK isn't going to get you the full benefits. You really want to be honing in and targeting a quality sleep, getting exercise or some kind of movement in daily, doing some form of fasting and getting some cold exposure in there. This is a super combo and this is going to keep you young. It's going to keep you performing well. It's going to keep your energy at a really good level. It's going to keep you sharp and focused and you're just going to be able to do that much more as you age. So hope you like this. Hope you found it helpful. If you want to get started, if you need to make a change, if your energy is not where you want it, if you're just feeling overwhelmed, you're feeling a lot of stress, if you're not doing the things that are important to you in your life, I've got a really quick two week video course that's going to help you double your energy. So there's a link below. There might be a little link that'll pop up somewhere here, but check that out. If you struggle with your energy, if you struggle with stress, if you lack the motivation to do what you want to do, this is going to help you. It's a free course and it's about 10 minutes a day. The lessons are about 10 minutes and you're going to be working up to about 10 minutes of new activities that you ideally you want to make these a permanent part of your life to get lasting benefits and results. And the longer you do these things, the better your health, the better the results are going to be. So I hope you found this helpful. If you have a question, put it below. If you like this, then uh, give it a like. I think it's over there. And uh, if you're not subscribed, get, uh, get subscribed. And I will see you real soon in a new video.